What's up mga kasining? Sana okay kayo and safe kayo ngayon. Nasan man kayo? So yung painting pala na to, ito yung ginawa ko nung nagsimula yung lockdown dito sa bayan namin sa Baguio. So ito yung dedication kong artwork para sa mga frontliners natin who is battling the COVID-19 pandemic. So tulad ng karamihan ng mga artworks, nagsisimula muna tayo sa sketching. Um, drawing before we paint. Yung style pala na gagawin natin dito is impasto technique. Yun yung style na gumagamit tayo ng makapal na paint na nakikita mo yung yung texture ng paint, lalo na kapag nag-dry siya. So what I'm doing right now is the block in stage. Yung first layer ng painting. Usually, nagsisimula ako mag-render ng artwork kapag kinukulayan ko na siya. Um, starting with the dark tones, and then a medium tone, and then yung pinaka-lightest uh, color. When you're painting nga pala, always make sure no, that you take time to paint your artwork. Huwag mo siya mamadaliin. Lalo na kapag hindi naman siya competition. You know, you enjoy the process of painting. You enjoy the journey. Yung paglapat mo ng paint dun sa canvas, yung brush strokes. When I paint nga pala, no, Make sure na malinis, maayos yung working area mo. I have this habit of cleaning up before starting a new painting. Minsan di ako makapag-concentrate ng mabuti sa painting eh kapag medyo magulo yung area, kapag magulo yung studio. Minsan kapag off yung balance, nung, yung pagsabit ng canvas sa paligid ko kung may banking na canvas minsan hindi ako makapag concentrate ng mabuti so I always make sure no, na maayos yung area and then yeah, me listening to the music a little bit of ambience kapag nagpipaint so one of the joys in painting for me is yung excitement and yung happiness mo no, sa pag buo ng image sa canvas paunti-unti You know, it's really different if you have this image on your mind compared to the actual image na nakikita mo. Okay, so we're done with the first part ng painting. This is the block in stage. Paint smudges lang siya actually. Hi guys, so before we proceed to the next painting session, please don't forget to like this video and please subscribe to my channel for more art and creativity content just like this one. Okay, now back to the video. So we are down to the second part ng painting. This is the rendering stage. This is one of the most exciting part ng painting process. No? Kasi tinatakpan mo yung mga paint smudges. You're giving them details. And also, uh, since we're doing impasto painting, I'm actually putting large amount of uh, paint ang pala of paint actually hindi siya ganun kakapal but you can actually see the texture okay, so instead of blending the colors totally minsan iniiwan ko na lang yung paint as is 
then I'm going to mix another color tone then yun yung ilalagay ko dun sa next area ng artwork Instead, it gives the painting a little bit of character not only texture mo but character kapag makapal yung pagpahid natin ng paint sa canvas so here's one technique that I do pag nag paint ako no? minsan ginagamit kong mixing palette yung mismong surface ng painting so naglalagay ako ng makapal na paint on the surface and then yun yung blini blend ko so shout out nga pala kay Karen Salagan she's a good friend of mine siya yung model ko dito sa painting na to now, we used to be co-workers so Karen ingat ka dyan sa field I remember when I was working in a corporate world before, una kong trabaho bago ako nag full-time artist. Ito yung hinahanap-hanap ko after ng trabaho ko. And after my shift, after my job, that's the time na I really try to find time uh, to hold the brush and paint. I paint every day. Kahit iba yung trabaho ko noon when I was starting out. Saan kailangan mo rin kasi maghanap ng uh, good source of income lalo na after, you know, after college. I really don't know where to go and I'm still trying to find out what's your place in this world. So minsan napupunta ka sa ibang trabaho na hindi mo naman talaga passion, hindi mo siya linya. But eventually, along the way, mahanap mo rin yung tamang road. Para sa'yo. So, one of the things na I'm really happy and proud to say na I made the right decision of resigning from my corporate job and pursuing my career as an artist. I've never been happier. I remember nga pala no, nung nagsimula itong COVID-19 pandemic na to. Nung nasa kalagitnaan tayo ng quarantine, there was a time na naging scarce. Kulang na yung supply ng mask. And even alcohol. Nagkanda ubusan siya sa market. And I remember nung nawalan na tayo ng supply ng face mask and face shields. People, yung mga tao naging creative. They create their own mask to create their own face mask and face shield and kita ko ngayon no, yung evolution ng face mask from a very simple plastic na naging fashion trend na siya which is quite cool by the way you know normally pinipaint natin yung background first you know always start from the farthest away going to the foreground uh, but sometimes you get too excited na gawin agad yung subject. And dito sa technique na to, no, sa empasto, pwedeng gawa ng paraan yung background. Minsan siya yung ginagawa natin kuli. But, but still, no, I still make sure na yung pinaka-foreground yun sa image natin, yun yung pinaka-huli natin ginagawa. <music> final part ng painting this is the detailing part so binabalikan ko na yung mga dating na pinturahan putting some minor details and of course yung pinakamasayang part ng painting process is yung paglagay mo ng signature Thank you so much guys for watching this painting process. Pag-ingat tayong lahat. 
we'll get over this. Stay safe. Stay at home hanggat kaya. And always take care guys.